The President, please be seated. Le Président, Mesdames et Messieurs, veuillez vous asseoir. Le Président, the court is now back in session. L'audience est reprise. Uncle Nat, uh, you did not yet uh, respond Nat, to my question vous pas that ma you question. said you saw the accused uh, visiting en train de dire que vous avez the place where you worked very often and you, how could you describe uh, his facial impression, whether he was happy, sad, or he was full of worries whenever he went to that location. So what can you tell us about this? Venez à l'atelier. Pouvez-vous nous parler ces éléments? Mr. Wanad, Mr. President, Réponse, Monsieur normally when he le Président. came into the workshop, uh, he was complimenting or, or he was appreciating our work, for example, the good job we done. And sometimes bon when we were behind the schedule, parfois, uh, then he was not uh, very happy. He was not very satisfied. The President, Question. you mentioned about Vous a avez portrait parlé you painted about a que vous avez torturing fait. scene Il in which you could see through a window from the place where you were working. And it was at night, and you said that in order to visualize the incident, you only uh, brought it to a portrait of the daylight. Vous avez fait en sorte and you que said that uh, déroule, une, you mentioned une scène qui about se déroule a la person journée. who could uh, mold a sculpture of a portrait, and that uh, he said he could make it faster, but then uh, he, he could not do, and then uh, the accused was present at that time. So when uh, the person who lors de cet incident said that they, he would be the good uh, scouter failed bon to Lorsqu'il keep his promise that he would be a good uh, scouter. So what happened to him? So had uh, you de lui? heard anything from the accused uh, whether uh, he passé? told something to that Le person or que implemented que him or else? De cette Mr. Van Nam, so far as I recall, réponse. When the person could not uh, do his work, then he asked uh, the guard to take him back. And then he left. And I don't know for sure what happened to uh, that person and I did not hear any orders uh, toward that particular individual but so far as I noticed uh, the gas had the right to do such thing very often uh, during the time when I worked as the painter because the gas uh, could do something spontaneously and made uh, such a decision uh, very often, spontaneously. The President, uh, you said that the guard could do something spontaneously. What kind of activities in which uh, the guards themselves could uh, make such decisions spontaneously so, uh, that you have observed? Leur propre, de leur Mr. propre Wanda, initiative. Réponse, Mr. Monsieur le Président. The East 
brother le who came de l'Est. to visit uh, the place where I worked. He se rendait I think, um, dans l'atelier où je travaillais. There was a kind of threatening. He said Après that if, uh, he, uh, if he could not uh, si work properly, ne, then he would si be ne pas bien at, in the hands of the guard. So I could il presume that, that the guards have, the f- Je have en exercised uh, the full rights to make their own decisions without any further consultation. De des décisions de leur sans avoir, um, par une consultation sans avoir passé par quelqu'un d'autre. The president, in your Question. statement, Dans votre déposition, before the co-investigating charges, there was an annex, a text, and there were Il, on trouve 13 sketches annexe. drawn by you Qui yourself. De votre propre Are main. all those sketches uh, or the paintings, uh, sorry, drawings, yours? Ces dessins sont-ils de votre main? Est-ce que c'est vous qui les avez faits? Mr. Wanat, yes, they are mine. Réponse, oui. The president, so that c'est moi qui les ai drawings Question. reflect the activities of uh, the officials of the Anka who uh, treated you personally or what? Qui, uh, des traitements qui vous ont été infligés Mr. Bannard, uh, the drawings. Qu'en est-il? Réponse. Les dessins. I would like to classify them into three des parts. First, I saw it en trois with my own eyes. Number two, I only heard, but I never saw it, but I could imagine how the situation, how it happened. And number three, I heard from prisoners who shared the room, so this is how the drawings could be produced. The president, the heavy Je unit, uh, could you please question attach the 13 drawings with ERN from 0, 0, 16, 3, 0, 0, 0, 1, 3734? Ah. And D28 slash 9. Could you please make sure that they are projected on the monitor? Je vous prie de bien vouloir afficher ces écrans sur nos moniteurs. The president, could you please start from the first drawing? Uh, uh, ERN 0016-3721 first. 
portant la cote The president, uh, the AV unit, uh, what happened? Could you please advise us whether it is possible to have it uh, projected on the monitors? Possible d'afficher ces dessins sur nos monitors, sur nos écrans. Merci. The President, the co-prosecutors, could you please be of any assistance uh, to uh, project that picture? Thank you. The President, with pleasure. Nos écrans. Le coprocureur international, avec plaisir. The President, uh, Uncle Wanan, could you please le président. observe Question the, du président. The, the pictures? Monsieur Van Nat, pouvez-vous regarder ces dessins? The President, please move to the next slide uh, and uh, until you reach the final uh, picture but please be slow passer lentement à l'écran chacun de ces dessins jusqu'au dernier de la série The President, thank you very much. The prosecutors, uh, could we please move to page zero zero one six three seven three one, please? Zero zero cent soixante trois sept cent trente et un, s'il vous plaît. Somme d'arrêt. The President, please uh, move to the camera and. Regarding the sketches, zero zero one six three seven three one. Seize trente sept trente et un en Khmer.
I'm sorry, Mr. President. Could you repeat the Khmer ERN, please? Monsieur le Président, intervient le coopérateur international. Pouvez-vous nous rappeler ou répéter la cote ERN en Khmer, s'il vous plaît? ERNs. 0, 0, 1, 6, 3, 7, 3, 1. And which page would you like to see, Mr. President? Le Coup Programme International, quelle page exactement est-ce que vous voulez faire apparaître à l'écran, Monsieur le Président? The President, page 18, please. Il s'agit de la page 18, s'il vous plaît. Homme, homme, rouge, ni homme, homme nat. The President, uh, Uncle Nat, uh, please look at this sketch. Uh, there were two people who could be the guards and a man who was sitting near a water jar and putting one of his hands into the jar. Uh, is it the sketch? Describing yourself or que other prisoners? Sur ce dessin, c'est vous. Vous vous décrivez vous-même. Vous décidez. Vous êtes dessiné vous-même. Mr. President, this photo, réponse. this sketches, shows my picture. Dessin. The first day I came downstairs. Illustre ce que j'ai vécu uh, la première fois. And it reminds me of my recollection. Uh, the memory that I could uh, see the light uh, that I could live when I was asked to shave my hair and moustache de me and ma moustache. from the day I was detained uh, until the day I had uh, a bath it had been almost uh, more than one month that I had the first bath uh, and I broke mois. a mirror a kind of glass that I could use to uh, reflect uh, myself inside uh, such a mirror. And I could see how um, weak I looked in that uh, mirror. And two guards were guarding me. The president. So this sketch is about uh, the treatment of the staff of the Khmer Rouge on care on you during the time when you were arrested from Baden Bong and sent to Phnom Penh at S21 to that workshop. Is that correct? Mr. Van that is correct, Your Honor. Effectivement, c'est exact. Mr. President, President, could uh, the co-prosecutor once again help show another picture with P00027 and the following pictures, please? Je peux vous demander de bien vouloir afficher ces images à l'écran. The president, uh, uncle, please look at this uh, picture. Question, Monsieur Van Nat. Je vous demande were de regarder a number of prisoners inside uh, a. On y voit room and people were shared called to the legs on an iron rod uh, and is it uh, your painting and does it reflect the real situation in which uh, prisoners were detained and while you also were detained at that time? Mr. Wanad. 
Mr. President, it is the room where Monsieur I once was detained de in, and it shows the exact number of people who mm, were detained at that time and how we put to sleep, uh, and that we could not sit up without any permission. And uh, only when we raised our hand to ask for permission to sit up that uh, the guard Cannot, could allow us to sit out. So this, uh, to sit up, this is how uh, we were treated. So could you please move to the next uh, photo or picture? Le président, pouvons-nous passer à la à l'image suivante? What about this Question. picture? Qu'en est-il de cette image? Qu'est-ce qu'elle illustre? Encore one uh, This picture is a about a prisoner who was detained in an individual cell under building C, A, B, and D. Because when I was first sent in under those buildings, there were individual cells. But later on, uh, only building A could have uh, the individual cells. The other cells were removed. So after any prisoner was interrogated, uh, then the hope was very slim that they could uh, survive or leave. That's why they were uh, detained into a, an individual cell and being desperate and hopeless. So, the president, uh, so you only draw this uh, picture or painted this picture based on your recollection of other people having told you or based on your experience? Um, par rapport, sur la base de ce Mr. Vanat, I used to see these cells réponse. because uh, Moi, during the time when I worked, uh, I would uh, pass um, some of the cells. Là, je Could you please move to the next devant certaines uh, de ces photo? Question, pouvez-vous passer à la peinture suivante? The President, uh, can you tell us anything about uh, this picture? What is it about? Faire un commentaire de la peinture que l'on voit ici. Mr. Wanat, uh, Mr. President, I did not see this incident. I only heard uh, from what happened in building B because. Uh, normally, the guards, four of shoe guards, would uh, take children from their parents, and I could hear the scream of those parents and the uh, the parents who would probably have uh, um, tried to take back their children from the guards. So it was based on my imagin uh, uh, imagination and what I heard. The next picture, please, say the president. The president, question, does this picture show la peinture suivante. anything. Could you please tell us? Pouvez-vous nous dire ce que décrit cette peinture? Mr. Wanat, uh, Mr. President, this Monsieur le Président. photo, this uh, uh, painting was drawn based on um, the information I was told by a prisoner who was interrogated uh, and uh, by waterboarding technique that he was suffocating, il, um, suffocating, correction. Une the president, could torture. you please show the fifth picture, please? Le president, pouvons-nous afficher la cinquième um, peinture? What, a, what about this uh, picture? Could you please Qu tell que us cette about peinture? it? Pouvez-vous nous... Faire vos commentaires. Mr. Wanat, uh, this picture Cette was peinture. drawn from the recollection of what the prisoner told me. Uh, Mr. Pa Thon Chan, the Vietnamese translator, during interrogation when Vietnamese were interrogated, he told me about this. And I think Brother East uh, knew that because uh, uh, he was placed. 
and, and immersed into a basin full with water and he um, drank too much of the water and then the, later on the guard would step on his stomach to make him vomit all those water and in 1981 the German people is German East German people who came to uh, file the document for S21 and he gestured uh, in uh, that movie, uh, the, that documentary about uh, uh, being immersed into that improvised basin and that's why I could uh, draw such a uh, painting based on his request of his recollection of the torture. De la the president, vis -vis des tortures qui infligé, uh, has he survived S21? Question, cette personne a-t-il survécu à S21? Said the president, uh, Mr. Wanat, uh, he réponse, had uh, survived, uh, but he died in, uh, in 2002. Et et décédé the president, could you please uh, show picture number six? Le président, pouvez-vous montrer la peinture numéro six, s'il vous plaît? Could you please describe the painting here? Ce qui est peint. Mr. Banat, uh, Mr. President, this Réponse, photo Monsieur or this President, picture uh, was not drawn from my uh, what I witnessed or from what uh, people told me, but uh, we can see these equipment to the south of the special prison. We saw these de la implements and then there um, was a meeting end of 1981 de and then we analyzed how the container was used uh, for torture during uh, that time. Torture. So there were two handcuffs and a tap, water tap. And the people could not. Uh, no, after the discussion, people uh, could uh, presume that uh, any prisoner would be hung and uh, then uh, plunged into the water in that container because there were cows inside the container, so it suggests that the, the head of any prisoner would be uh, immersed under the water. So that's why I think uh, it, it based on from what we analyzed during that time. President, thank you. Could you please show the next painting? President, je vous remercie. Pouvons-nous passer à la peinture suivante? President, Question. what about this painting? Qu what does it peinture? show? Que dépeint elle? One nod. Mm, réponse. This painting was drawn based on a description of a female prisoner from the kitchen. I occasionally went into the kitchen la, la and briefly she told me et elle m'a brièvement raconté Ce avait vu. She told me that she lost, she lost her female character, and I did not ask her in detail, and she said she was interrogated and that her female character was lost, and with the scorpion, with the Poisonous insect were based on the descriptions of the guards. There was an old guard, he was feeding those the insects. And when I asked him what he did, he told me that he was asked to feed those insects. And sometimes he fed those insects with ants. And sometimes they would come and take those insects or the interpit. And when I asked the female prisoner, she said she was interrogated 
and she was bitten with that interpete. Thank you, Mr. President. Please move on to the next painting. Question, painter suivant. The President, what does the painting reflect? The types of torture? Que voit-on ici? C'est une torture, une technique One de minute. torture. Réponse. Mr. President, a victim, but he already passed away. His oui, name was Ung Pek. He was the. Il s'appelait Ung Pek, mais il est mort depuis. He used to be the chairman of the Genocide Museum of Old Slang. He told me that his nails were pulled in that way. De cette manière là. So he lost some of the fingernails as the result of these types of torture. So I painted this image for him. As a souvenir. Un, un, un souvenir. So this one reflects the actual torture done to by the S21 staff on Unpike. And the question S21. is, after you did the painting, Après cette peinture, was Unpike still alive? To, and whether he received it and he reflected that it was the actual torture reflection on him? One uh, to Mr. President, réponse. from what I can recall, the S21 Museum Le musée was opened in 1981, en 1981. And he died in 1997. Et Ung Peck est mort en so 1997. So he hated that picture for more than 10 years. Donc il a eu ce tableau pour Thank sa you, Please move on to the next uh, Merci, painting. That is painting number nine. Image suivante, il s'agit de la peinture numéro neuf. The president, can you describe this uh, painting? Pouvez-vous nous dire ce que l'on voit ici? One nod. Réponse. This painting was a reflection of a booming. Ce tableau reflète ce que Boumé m'a raconté. That he describes the way he was tortured, that they took turns to torture les interrogateurs. Beat him up. So I made that painting for Boumé. Et j'ai fait cette peinture pour Boumé. Thank you, Mr. President. Please move to painting number ten. Ici, nous passons à la peinture numéro, au tableau numéro dix. The President. What about this painting? Can you describe the, the painting? What does it reflect? One matter, Mr. Réponse. President. It is unclear. I only made this painting to reflect uh, what happened at June 8 uh, from the hearsay, but I don't think it was the way it was done, but because of the unclear information, and actually only one hand was tied, and after the person was dead, then the throat was slashed. So this painting does not reflect Mais the reality. Cette, uh, so it was less cruel than what happened at Jing Ai. At Jing Ai, en fait, at Jing Ai the tight was not done in that way. After the person was clapped and died, then a throat was slashed. That's what I learned later by a person who used to be a former person in the Special Force Group. Thank you, says Mr. President. Please move on to painting number 12. Question. Merci. Nous passons au tableau numéro 12. So you already described uh, this painting. Vous avez déjà décrit cette scène. The reflection of torture on a person who most is to be a good artist. But it turned out that 
mais qui finalement he was not a real artist then the accused être artiste ordered him to be returned and then the guards donc, euh, tortured him that way and you saw this view during the night but in order to make it easier on the night in the painting you painted it as it happened during the day is this the picture that you, you refer to c'est bien cela de vous parler tout à l'heure. But not. that is correct, Réponse. Mr. Oui, President. Exact, Monsieur le Président. Please move on to painting number 13, says the President. Passons au tableau numéro 13. And what about this painting? Et que voit-on ici? What does it reflect? I saw two people carrying a very skinny person qui, uh, whose hands and feet were tied into a wooden pole. One Mr. President, I saw this uh, incident personally. C'est un incident auquel j'ai assisté personnellement. Quand on transportait les prisonniers, I thought they would be moved out and to be integrated into the cooperatives for rice production, for instance. That's what I thought. Je pense à l'époque que les personnes could not walk. Dans une coopérative, he didn't eat, mais ici, il s'agit d'une personne and he qui était so sick for quite some time, and he could not walk by himself. Temps, il était so that mourir. was the way that he was carried by young guards, about 15 to 16 years old. De 15 and when I ans, turned my head and I saw this incident, quelque chose que vu moi -même. and I was rather moved and shocked et ça by what I saw. I saw the person already died, Je but actually he was uh, still speaking. En fait, il était de and his eyes were blindfolded, so it means he et was not yet dead. So he was taken out to be put into the trap mort, which was waiting outside. President, please move on to the last painting, Question. number 14. Tableau, 14. And this painting drawn by you, what does it reflect? Que vous avez peint aussi, uh, And uh, what is the likely location of your reflection in this painting? Et où est-ce que cela se passe? One not, Mr. Réponse. President. After I heard about Chiang Ai as a, a burial mass grave site, we went there and we saw a lot of mass graves. So we knew about the, the umbrella branches of S21 at Chiang Ai, where people were killed. Thank you, says Mr. President. Question. Merci. You left the security office S21, and when was that? Quand avez-vous quitté le centre de sécurité S21? When, uh, Mr. Réponse. President, I left the S21 compound on the 7th January 1978 at uh, 12:30 noon. À How many went along with you Question. and where Combien did you go? Se avec vous as et the president. Vous allez? When, uh, to Mr. President, Réponse. on that day after I heard the gun explosion on the main street, we were gathered into the uh, painting workshop. There were woodcrafter and some other artists, totaling more than 10. There were about 12 or 13 of us in the workshop. At about half an hour later, that was 12.30 noon, there were five, four or five armed guards came and ordered us to leave the room, to walk in one line, to follow them, and they threatened us to walk in one straight line. If we stay one, one 
If we made one step out of the line, we would be shot dead. Si we were so scared. We were so scared. We were so scared. And I thought that was the time. So we walked. I did not even dare to pick up my scarf. It was uh, nearby. I only had the cluster on me. So we followed them walking across the Tul Tumpung Market. That was so quiet at the time. So we walked past that area, down to Bang Tumpung area, and toward Chem Ka Dong. And we arrived at Preysor almost at dusk. And when we arrived there, we saw a lot of people who were already there. And we walked throughout the night. So because of the chaotic situation, some of us are separated. And we reunited in the early morning. Au petit matin. And then I walked and I almost reached Ang Snul. Je suis arrivé presque à Ang Snul. The four or five prison guards were Les already waiting for us there. Nous y attendaient déjà. So it, we did not have anything to eat for one day already on Et the 7th of January. Faisait déjà plus d'un jour que nous n'avions rien mangé. And on the 8th of January, when we were when we arrived at that location, endroit, the soldiers asked, asked us to eat les soldats, the watermelons, and after that we had to cross National Road Number 4, and then that we would be 4, out of Ham's way. Ham's way. On nous a dit que là, nous serions hors de danger. So in, at 8 a.m. in the morning, we matin, crossed the National Road Number 4, number 4 in a, a number of lines. There were some lines to the right and to the right of my line. Il y avait des rangs aussi à gauche, à ma gauche et à ma droite. We almost reached the National Road Number Four. It's about a hundred meters away. We saw a we saw some tracks with the Vietnamese and Cambodian soldiers on the tracks with a flag displaying on the track. The line on the right of my line fired at those tracks, and then they responded, and then there was an exchange of fire. And those forces who guided us fled in separate directions. So we all separated. Ying Chan, Ng Pat, and Ta Kong and I were the only four in one group. So we waited for nous those who would arrive later on. For example, we expected that maybe there would be guards or, or other prisoners who would arrive, so we would wait for them. And we dare not to go anywhere because we were afraid that the Vietnamese soldiers would uh, shoot us and kill us. And because we were so hungry, we did not have anything to eat. So we were waiting nearby the main road. De la route principale. So when we make a decision whether to follow them or not, and si I was afraid that uh, peur, I would be dead if I had to follow them, uh, because we did not have si anything to eat, and I wanted to go back to Phnom Penh. Moi, je Phnom Penh. But then I was told if I go back to Phnom Penh, Phnom Penh, Phnom Penh then my Phnom Penh, throat would be slashed by Vietnamese soldiers. I, myself, I... Did, I am. I was determined to go back to Phnom Penh, and the two or three of them then followed me. And then we saw some tracks uh, driving by, and they waved to us not to go to that direction. And on the 8th of January at 4 p.m., I felt a bit uh, liberal. And when we arrived in Phnom Penh, it was the 10th of January, and there were some Cambodian soldiers waiting to receive us. They were friendly, they gave us rice and food with amongst with other people. And there were only four of us in the group. About uh, one year later, Après of Later, after the museum was established, then ouvert, we saw three others, Bu Mei, Pa Tong Chan, and Chum Mei. Mei. So, initially, only four of us uh, who arrived. This is my response, Mr. President. Thank you, Mr. President.
Armies of the National United Front with the support of the Vietnamese soldiers to come and liberate Phnom Penh. And when you left, that you were ordered to walk in one line. The question is, for the remaining prisoners, how many of them all together? And when you were asked to go along with them, de partir. Besides the guns pointing at you, were you carved over a string used to tie it all of you up? Joue, est -ce que vous aviez les mains liées, But ou not, vous Mr. President, from what I can recall, réponse. at that Autant time, souvienne, we left the painting workshop, nous there were woodcrafters, electricians, electricians, blacksmiths, and there were about 13 of us. Et nous étions à peu près 13. And we were ordered to leave, but we partir, were not tied or handcuffed. We walked with our bare hands, but we were ordered to walk only in one straight Mais line. Nous a fait mettre en And fil. there were no other prisoners remained in the prison. Probably only a few left after the October or November. The prison were quiet since that time. There was a special prison at building A. There were some when I left. When I left, there were some of them there. I saw their heads from what we saw from the distance, but we didn't know when they died. The remaining prisoners who were later on buried there, how many of them did you see? Avez-vous vu de prisonniers qui sont restés là qui ont été tués et enterrés au musée de Tulslang? Réponse. I saw 14 burials. J'ai vu 14 tombes. Locations or tombs here at the Tulslang Museum. So I presume there were 14 of them left. And later on, the chairman made a concrete tomb for those 14 people who died. Pour ces 14 personnes qui sont mortes. JP, President. Question. Regarding your personal matter, when my rules on gas arrested you and sent you from Battambang to Phnom Penh to be detained at S21 detention center, what happened to your family, your wife and children? Because you have not yet mentioned about your family. One night, uh, Mr. President, Réponse. on the day I was arrested, I, I only was arrested alone, and my Moi, arrêté, wife and children at, were at the cooperative number five. À la coopérative numéro cinq. I had two children studying with enfants, my wife, the eldest femme, was five, and the youngest was six months old. Que six mois. After I was Freed, and after I returned, Quand I learned libéré, that my children died. J'ai appris que mes enfants étaient morts. Only my wife survived. Seule ma femme avait survécu. And she's with me at present time. Et elle est toujours avec moi aujourd'hui. Thank you for your information in Question. this testimony. Merci to pour votre témoignage. The, the incidents and events that Merci you went through during the Democratic Cambodia from the 17 April 1975. Through the et le 7, 7 of January 1979, sur le corps de la démocratique. Pour leur demander s'ils ont des questions à poser witness, au Related to the fact of uh, S21, S21 concernant les faits survenus à S21.
Judge Lavange, you take the floor. Judge Lavange, vous en prie. Est-ce que vous Judge pourriez Lavergne, nous expliquer les difficultés que vous avez rencontrées après votre libération de S21 et l'expérience dramatique que vous y avez vécue et comment vous avez pu éventuellement surmonter ces épreuves The one year period of my detention at S21 was the period that I tried my best emotionally and physically to accomplish the task ordered by Anka. I tried to use all the skills I had to complete, to accomplish those tasks for the only purpose that is survival. De faire et ce dans un seul but, so, my suffering and my separation that happened to me et les souffrances et la séparation que j'ai endurées during the one year period pendant and during année, the three years eight months period of the regime as a whole et pendant les trois années et huit mois de cannot be erased easily from my memory even I tried my best to forget essayé. and try not to remember it still haunts me mais ce sont des souvenirs qui me hantent toujours it still makes me to remember je me souviens toujours of what happened de ce qui s'est passé so in summary it cannot be forgotten Et en bref, on ne peut pas oublier. I don't think I can ever never forget what happens to me, Your Honor. Monsieur le Juge. Judge Lavergne. Nous l'avons vu. Vous avez peint beaucoup de tableaux. Si j'ai bien compris, d'ailleurs, vous êtes revenu peu de temps après votre libération sur les lieux mêmes pour peindre les tableaux. Vous avez participé à des documentaires. Vous avez, je crois, aussi écrit un livre. Est-ce que vous pouvez nous dire pourquoi Il est aussi important pour vous de pouvoir témoigner. I was detained ce que at S21. I determined que déjà if one day I survived si jour, and had freedom si jour, and liberté, that I could leave that location, I would si compile the events je rassemblerai ces événements. To reflect of what happened, so that the pour, uh, younger generation knew would know of our suffering, uh, les par and that the 36 of us who were transferred to S21 never committed anything wrong. Avec moi, des gens qui rien, qui Therefore, those rien who came mal. along with me through S21, the majority of S21, them did not know anything or any offense that they that would lead to their arrest. They were perplexed as to what happened, why they were arrested. So I had to reveal, I had to write, I had to compile. 
and it can be served as a mirror to reflect et to the younger generation of the lives of those who were accused jeunes, jeune with no reason pour leur who committed que no wrong raison, and that they were punished that way. Ont été that was the puni. very suffering that we received Je voulais leur montrer les souffrances que nous avons endurées. And the suffering that we had because we told them the truth and they did not believe it. And there was nothing else more than that. That's why I, I determined, I attempted and I tried to explain to the younger children through various programs. Et aux enfants dans le cadre de divers programmes. Through them so that the younger generation would understand the experience so that they would consider and that they would try to avoid the repeat of such historical events. Vous-même, aujourd'hui, vous êtes venu témoigner. Est-ce que vous attendez quelque chose de particulier de ce procès Est-ce que vous souhaitez quelque chose en particulier I have thought from the beginning that was uh, after 1979, I never imagined that I would be able to sit in this courtroom today to describe about my plight of the experience to the younger generations, to the general public to understand of what happened to me. And now I have the ability to testify before this chamber in public this is my privilege. This is my honor. I do not want anything more than that. Je ne demande rien de plus. What I want is something that is intangible, that is the justice for those who already died. Whatever way the justice could be done is the, my only hope that Donc, can be achieved by this chamber. C'est ce que j'attends de la chambre. And I hope by the end of the compte, tribunal, the justice can be tangible, can be seen by everybody. Tribunal, and that rendue, is something that I expect as a monde, result, as an outcome voilà of this chamber, of this tribunal. And this tribunal. is uh, what I want, John. Voilà ce que je souhaite. Je voudrais Judge revenir Lavergne. sur un incident like un peu particulier dont vous aviez fait état qui concernait un autre peintre, un autre peintre qui travaillait avec vous dans l'atelier et d'un incident entre ce peintre et Douk. Je parlais d'un incident concernant Boumang. Est-ce que vous vous souvenez de ce qui s'est passé entre Boumang et Douk Mr. Van Nat, Your Honor, Bu Meng was tortured. Oui, Monsieur le Juge, Bu Meng a été torturé for his mistakes, but I don't know what kind of mistakes he had. Pour l'erreur qu'il avait faite, mais je ne sais pas quelle erreur il a pu faire. Mais à ce moment-là, vers 11 heures du soir. We were about to break from work. Then there was a guard, un garde est venu. Uh, Mr. Peng, Peng est venu. Uh, rather higher senior or senior staff. Qui était un and then he was uh, watching us at the place for Et some time, and I was scared. Un certain but temps. I did not ask him any question. I just continued working. Juste continué à and then later on, he said. Puis, Contemptible Ming, Il a get dit, out. Uh, ah, Ming, and then left uh, Ming wore his uh, shirt on, Ming and then he left uh, 
And then I asked him Il that sorti. now the guard asked you to go out and when you come back, don't forget the cigarette uh, to bring, bring the cigarette for me also. Then when he left, uh, I never saw him again Il for long. I was waiting to see him back, Et but it was in vain. Mais and uh, en I thought that probably he would be released and integrated into the cooperative. But uh, after about two weeks, Mais après environ deux semaines, I took a rest, I mean after work, and I was about to fall asleep, then I heard someone calling from downstairs et and uh, asked me to uh, send back the painter, uh, the, the guard to send the painter, and I thought, uh, what would happen then? Then I peintre. came downstairs and I Donc was working, working, was back to work. Je there were four people, Il y avait quatre comrade Jan, Kun, I, myself, and another person, and we did not know what would happen. A little while later, un peu plus tard, we heard uh, the sound of the chain with, which were being dragged along the corridor, and then at the door, couloir, we saw Meng, Meng, who was chained to his neck and qui avait une chaîne au cou. legs, and he was pale, and his hair grew longer, très pâle, and ses cheveux avaient my heart poussé. beat so Et mon quickly cœur mis à at battre that très moment. Vite. And Brother East was there at the, that Est moment. Était là aussi à ce moment -là. And then Ming was called in. On and he said, contemptible Ming, Ming what, uh, what uh, had Ming, you promised to me? Que tu promis? And then Bu Ming said, I did Bu not Ming know dit, anything. Je sais pas, and then he sat right in front Il of me, kneeled moi, down and uh, apologized et, uh, to everyone excuse-toi devant tout le monde. And actually, I did not know anything Moi, about uh, what happened to him when he was taken away. And then he was taken back. Et on ramené. And Mais later on, uh, uh, he said that uh, whether contemptible men could be used any longer or uh, que, uh, could he be used to make fertilizer? And I thought that fertilizer here means the, uh, uh, the fertilizer for uh, plants or crops at the cooperative. And then uh, uh, and I thought that uh, since he was also an artist uh, and when he was made to work uh, uh, to make fertilizer, it would not be a proper job for him. So that's why I talked to him that uh, please um, forgive him for his wrongdoing and uh, that leave, uh, give him an opportunity to stay here and if he made a further mistake, then he would uh, uh, be decided. Uh, Et s'il fait encore une fois une erreur à ce moment-là, on pourra I think he probably did not uh, listen to me, but since uh, Meng could uh, be a good painter, then uh, he si would Meng be longer bon used print, at uh, that location, si and his leg like, was shackled, uh, chained, bon. and then he asked me to watch him and that he must not move gens, any inches ensuite, from that location and that was the last chance that he could correct himself. So he, would, he was back to work. So this is what I could recall um, about that person, Your Honor. Voilà, the president it is now time for lunch, so the chamber Lors would like to take arrivé. an adjournment until 1.30 p.m. Nous reprendrons l'audience à 13h30.
มนตรีตุลาการยึดยอมสำหรับรุ่นคุณจูนให้ทราบว่าผู้เขาใช้ในห้องพักที่เขาอาศัยอยู่และให้ประทานอาหารและฟูดที่ได้รับประทานและให้ประทานอาหารที่ได้รับประทานและให้ประทานอาหารที่ได้รับประทานและให้ประทานอาหารที่ได้รับประทานและให้ประทานอาหารที่ได้รับประทานและให้ประทานอาหารที่ได้รับประทานและให้ประทานอาหารที่ได้รับประทานและให้ประทานอาหารที่ได้รับประทานและให้ประทานอาหารที่ได้รับประทานและให้ประทานอาหารที่ได้รับประทานและให้ประทานอาหารที่ได้รับประทานและให้ประทานอาหารที่ได้รับประทานและให้ประทานอาหารที่ได้รับประทานและให้ประทานอาหารที่ได้รับประทานและให้ประทานอาหารที่ได้รับประทานและให้ประทานอาหารที่ได้รับประทานและให้ประทานอาหารที่ได้รับประทานและ